Hello Snowflakers, it's Lorna again. You'll see me for the first 25 days of December as I tell you about some of the most important and famous symbols of English Christmas time. So today is the 6th of December and let's open door number six to see what we can find. So this is a picture of presents and toys. And if you ask any English children, they will say that for them, this is the most exciting and important part of Christmas. Now, as I told you in the day in yesterday and the day before's videos, these are presents made in the North Pole by Father Christmas and his elves. Now, when the presents arrive in the stockings and under the tree, which is where Father Christmas leaves them sometimes, you'll find them wrapped in beautiful coloured paper sometimes with ribbons and sometimes with bows on them, often red and green and silver and gold, which are the colours that we associate with Christmas. Now, in December, early December, each child writes a list of the things that he would like most in the world. And we put it in an envelope and we can either post it to Father Christmas at the North Pole in a post box, or we can put it in the fireplace and burn it and it will go up to Father Christmas and it will tell him everything that that child wants. And as I said before in the other videos, so if you have been a good boy or girl all year, you will have your name on Santa's good list. And he keeps that in a big book in his office. But if you have been a bad boy or girl for too many days in the year, Father Christmas will stroke his beard and look at the list and decide that perhaps you don't deserve any presents or toys. And as I said before, he might put a big lump of coal in your stocking. And you don't want that, do you? What would you like for Christmas? What would you write on your Christmas list? Maybe you could have a go and find out. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.